Hi there, Marcus again from 4Pods. Uh, another option we've added into our latest version of 4Pods is the ability to do a name change. We often get customers that say, well, I registered my company name in a different name or their ownership has changed or whatever the reason is. In the past, we used to ask 500 Rand for our time to log in through TeamViewer and manually change it. We've now given you an option to change it yourself. So you, all you need to do is go to store setup and security as you saw a general parameters let's just do it one more time general parameters and then next to the company name there you can and see that you can change it you simply click on uh, yes you want to change the company name and again that old name will come up there and then I can just change it to whatever it, I need it to be and click OK once I've clicked OK the system comes up and says a mail has been sent to your registered email in other words that's the email address which was used to register this uh, company in the first place. Um, so you can just check your, your link up in there. And now I can close my 4Pos back office. Uh, go and check my emails. Once the email has been received, I can click on the link. And once the link has been approved, then the system will automatically change the name to the new company name. A couple of minutes later, you'll see that it will pop up. Uh, your email will come through that says, Thanks for the support. You have requested to change the company name. This is the old name. That's a new name. Um, if it is you, please click on the link below and reopen the 4Pos back office. Now, it's only if it's you. Uh, if you got the email because somebody else tried to do the same with your voucher number, etc., etc., uh, please do not click on confirm because that will obviously create a problem. Uh, you somebody else would have been able to get hold of your information then and then will you click on the, the link your request for a company name change has been received and away we go all right so I can open up my back office program again uh, probably for you want to allow that yes all right so once your back office is open um, you'll just log in with your default passwords or your passwords as per usual the same passwords that you set up on a previous occasion in my case and as you can see, my customer or my business name has changed to my busy restaurant. And that's as simple as it is. Enjoy.